Hello and welcome to another video brought to you by the good people at FM Wonder Kids. The next episode in our Man United career mode. We spanked Crystal Palace 6 0 by performance managing our squad last game out. Today we're taking on B A T E or Bate in the Europa Cup at Old Trafford. So it should be a very simple one. We've made a few tactical tweaks, which we'll just show you about now. We've added tight marking. To Lindelof and Maguire, we've added tackle harder to our two wingers. Reason being, we, we normally add this into our tactics um, here at FM One. The kids' reason being, we want our we don't want to give fouls away on that side of the pitch. We don't mind giving them on that side of the pitch, and also we want our defenders to defend properly. But we don't necessarily want our deep line playmaker to be marking people tightly because when we win the ball. We want him to be free and in space rather than right next to an opponent. So just a couple of little tiny tweaks there. Um, obviously, we, we smashed Crystal Palace 6-0, so we don't want to be making wholesale changes. So we'll have a look at the squad now, and we'll pick the squad. Um, don't forget to like the video. Smash a like if you appreciate what we do here. It helps us out a lot. If you want to download our tactics, head on over to Patreon, and the Attack and Press is up there as we speak as well as all the other tactics and all the shortlists that we use subscribe if you are new why should you subscribe well every one monday we've got one of the kids videos going up every wednesday we've got the wolverhampton one of the kids save going up and every friday we've got the man united career mode up like i say head on over to patreon all the goodies are over there so let's pick our squad so go onto the squad screen here this is the one we are like to use no doubt about it so obviously we've got a 6-0 winning team here so i'm tempted to just play the same team again but i know we have got some youngsters on the pitch so i'll just double check that they're okay um what we will do is i will have a little look and i'll see where we're standing in the group here um, so we do need to win this game okay so we'll pick a strong team we'll pick up we'll pick our strongest team so we'll go Right midfield, we know is Arashi. Left midfield, we know is Martial. Up front, we know is Dembele. So that's our front three. If we if they're not injured and they're not out of form, that is our first choice front three. Rashford and Pog, uh, Madison and Pogba then in the middle. So where's Paul Poggers? Right on the bottom there. Pogba is the box to box, most probably, and James Madison is the Mazela, if that is how you pronounce it at all. Never is then in the deep line playmaking role. Luke Shaw left back, Harry Maguire right side, Lindelof left side. Um, let me know in the comments if you'd switch those two around. But we got Wan Bissaka right back and Dave the save in goal. So that's the front, that's the first 11. We'll put a couple of boys on the bench who did well for us in the last game. The likes of Dylan Levitt. The likes of Angel Gomez. And the likes of Pereira. Greenwood hasn't been playing well at all, so Greenwood doesn't take his place on the bench. Let's have a look at that. Is there anyone we're missing out on? Phil Jones, Lingard. Dan James, Greenwood, Twan CB, Matter, and no. Okay, so we're happy with our team. We'll go ahead and proceed to the match. Mike Phelan, as we know, is taking our team talks. Let me just go ahead and adjust my camera here. Notice we got the Man United top on today. Get the badge out. Okay, so that's the team. BATE, Obate. Shouldn't be a difficult opposition, especially at home at Old Trafford. So we'll send Mike to view that one. So I like to pause it here sometimes and just take a look at the shape of the team. Uh, Lindelof probably won't win that header, although, to be fair, he has actually been winning headers in the game, if you've been watching the series so far. So you've got good shape there. Lindelof wins the header. Good. To Madison, to Maguire, to Neves. Oh, we have actually instructed Neves on the, um, the tactical screen. Oh, what a goal there from Rashi. 
Uh, we've instructed Neves uh, to pass more directly. So I think Rashford takes that on from there. Well, I'll play Rashi, playing on the right wing. Is it inside forward? Smash that with his left boot. Yeah, that's our front three. So Dembele, let me know in the comments what you think of that front three. Would you be happy with that in real life? Rashi, Dembele, Martial. Quite tasty. Last with the corner into Dembele. Lindelof looks like he got a touch to it. Lindelof scores. That's another corner. If you've been watching from the start, you know we were having issues with our corners to start with. But we're happy with that one. That's 2 0. Very good indeed. Neves out to Basaka. Paul Pogba goes for a shot. Nice way, Poggers. Very, very good. Pogba picks it up in his box to box roll. Plays across into the left back shore, who has two shots. One from a rebound. Madison to Martial. Back to Madison. Out to Luke Shaw. Surely he's going to put a cross in. Yes, he does. Dembele with a header straight to the goalkeeper. 15 shots. Two goals. So, Madison pings one in. I think that's his first goal for United. Probably wrong, actually. But I can't remember him scoring yet. That's good. Pogba, Madison in the middle, Neves. Really happy. That's a world class midfield for us. As well as the front three, we're really happy with that. And the back four we're quite happy with. I mean, Lindelof is probably the, the weak link in the team, but he's he's actually really good in terms of stats. And his performances have been okay as well. So we like him. Can't argue with that. Three now at half time. Might make a substitution or maybe a double substitution at half time. Bring some of the kids on. Maybe we'll leave it till 60 minutes. Sure. Throw in to Neves. Back to Maguire. Happy with the ball at his feet is Harry Maguire. Wambasak has been playing very well for us. Paul Pogba with a shot from outside the box. It's a scorcher. Hot stuff from Paul Pogba. Shouldn't get too carried away. Obviously, Crystal Palace and Barte. Not exactly the Juventus and Real Madrid. But you can only beat the teams that are put in front of you. As Dembele goes through and scores. 54 minutes gone. Let's see if you can play some of the kids. So put Dylan Levitt on for Martial. Rashford's only got 70%, so we'll take him off as well for Angel Gomez, I think. Good, so we're happy with this. Another win under the belt by the look of it. What's going on there? Was it a foul or is it just an injury? 29 shots. That is very, very good, so we're happy with the way this tactic's coming out at the moment. 9.2 from Dembele and a 9.2 from Pogba as well. So really quick smash and grab today. Thank you very much, lads. Sixty-nine minutes gone. Let's see if we can make that third substitution. Ethan Laird. Be nice to get him a game. We know he develops quite well. Give Wamba Saka a rest, maybe. Why not? Dembele into Levitt. Has a shot. Dembele back to Shaw. Into Dembele. Into Madison. Keeps the ball, even under pressure. Out to Pogba. Sprays out to Ethan Laird. Manages to keep it in. Ball bounces around in the box. Out to Luke Shaw. Dylan Levitt, number 31. Puts it into Pogba. Puts it wide. 5 0 at Old Trafford. 74 minutes gone. 
77, 78, 79, 80 minutes gone. Gomez has got a yellow card. He's on a 6.7. Paul Pogba is 9.3. Dembele is 9.3 as well. They've had two bookings. We've had 38 shots with 21 on target. We scored five. That's 90 minutes. That is the game done and dusted. 40 shots in all. 69% possession. We'll head over to the team talk. Mike has done a green team talk which is always good okay that's good we're happy with that result have a little go a little go through the news feed for you here as well five star man united triumph we qualify for the first round so that's the qualification done we'll have a little look at the group then as well shall we three nil against bate in group c Still only puts a second in the group. We've played six games. One, two, three, four, five, six. We played all the games in Europe and became second in the group behind AZ Alpha. So it'll be interesting to see the draw draw when it goes ahead. Received a couple of pence from that. Marion raises player fitness concerns. Pogba and Neves. Pogba was on form today, to be fair. Probably the best performance we've seen him have. Um it's a 9.3. Dembele also sorry, had a 9.3. We'll give him a praise. See how that works. Always go passionate for me. Um, you're superb with the number of quality chances created. Thanks, boss. We're happy with that. Well done, Paul. Onwards and upwards then for the next game. Two days' time against Norwich City. Mike Phelan is confident of success. Mike Phelan faced a number of questions about the cup round and his reaction to the match from 4-4-2. The Belarusian Football the Gazette and Sky Sports News following Man United convincing a 5-0 Euro Cup Group C victory over Barte. Assistant Manager Mike Phelan had been asked to attend a press conference in place of Manager Mahatma Gandhi. 4-4-2 chose the main focus points for the conference with journalist Kyle Sutherland asking Today's result sees your team through to the next round of the competition. And you must be delighted. Do you think you can go all the way and win it? Mike obviously came out responding calmly. I think we've got a fantastic chance of doing just that. Guys, thank you very much for watching. Smash a like on the video. Head on over to Patreon. Monday, Wednesday and Friday. Don't forget, new videos up on YouTube. Join us next time against Norwich.